Okay, guys, I'm going to go with the uh, K-Bar short. That's what I'm going to do. That's what I feel like doing. I feel like doing that. Did I tell you that? Let's go throw it. Okay. This is the K-Bar Tonto Partial Serrated. I'm holding it like this. Okay. For underhanded, I hold the same way. Okay, so you saw how I'm holding. I hold it right here. I know, I, look, I'm no professional at this. I work at it every day. There's gonna be, there's guys out there that throw a lot better than me, okay? And there's different ways that the people throw. And there's some people that throw by the, by the blade, okay? Whatever works for you guys, you know what I'm saying? This is the way I was taught and it works for me. I was taught to throw it from here not the blade, because when I take it out of the sheath, it's in my hand. And there is one thing that I think everybody would have in common, uh, will agree on, that throw knives, is you're not flicking it. You don't want to flick your wrist. You want to follow through. And I know there's the no spin, 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 whatever works for you, okay? And I'm doing the spin. Always have. I have done the no spins, and I'm just not really fond of it. And you're thinking, why? It's just whatever works for you, you know, you're comfortable with. So I hope that helped right there. Uh, you can watch this. Uh, watch any of my videos, and you'll see how I'm throwing. Okay. So, I'm throwing like this. I get here. See, I'm throwing like this. Like that. And I always got my, I got my left foot forward. That's me, okay? And I am right-handed. And then, when I throw underhanded, same thing. I'm going down like this, but I'm going up. Like that. And I'm releasing them both right when I'm at the target, right there. Right when it's at my target. That's why I'm hitting that bullseye. See, that's more important to me to hit in this area here. And I'm really happy when I hit this, okay? That's my zone, okay? Now I can go all back here, back here, and we can hit it all over the place. We can have fun with it, but I just like to practice the bullseye. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm going to work out with this. I'm going to do a short. And uh, maybe I'll do some underhanders too in there. I don't know. I've done it before. But I hope that answers your questions. There was a couple of people, my favorite subscribers, that asked me uh, about showing me doing the how I hold it. And believe it or not, I hold it right down here. I'm not holding it here. I'm not doing a no spin. I'm holding it right here. Okay, that's because I'm pulling out of my sheath and it's ready. I'm not pulling out of my sheath and then trying to handle the blade. That just doesn't work for me. But if it works for you, please do it. That's all I ask. And uh, any of you guys, all you you guys, there's a, some guys out there. I, I'm subscribed to their channels. They're awesome, awesome throwers. They throw a lot better than me. They really do. And uh, it's just whatever works for you. You know what I mean? And the way I do it, like I get uh, comments sometimes about go back further, you're too close. And I did it just to, sh cause just to uh, quiet it down. You know, I can do it. But I'm not going to do that. I'm, I'm practicing right where I want to be. You know what I mean? Uh, now, if you want to do recreation throwing, that I've done that. We can do that. I can go over here and throw it at an angle and heave it. You know, I can run and uh, and pop it. That's that's recreation to me. I'm just uh, I'm practicing kind of like my precision on that bullseye. Now that I talked your ears off, let me get a short done on this. At first, I'm gonna throw. 
now I got to get it out of my system. I'm going to throw, and then we'll uh, finish talking about it, okay? I appreciate you guys. Okay, that felt good. I had uh, I got about 30 throws, and I'm going to close it out here uh, so we can ring the bell. And I hope I didn't uh, upset anybody, but uh, I shouldn't have because it, it's it's whatever works for you, do it. You know what I mean? And that works for me. We'll go clean it up. Okay, just clean it up. They make another uh, uh, mixture of this I'm going to get. It's kind of like a silicone or slicker. I think that'd be kind of awesome for, uh, you know, pivots and all that stuff. Might be good for the blade, too. Anyway, I got it all cleaned up. And I hope I wasn't uh, sounding like a professional uh, know-it-all when I was throwing. But I was just asked how I threw my knives. They wanted to see how I threw it, held it, and also for the underhand. Because uh, this particular these people sometimes people throw them with the blade and like I explained out there I don't do that because I'm taking it out of my sheath uh, I'm not doing a no spin and I'm not holding it like this I'm holding it back here okay I do that on all my knives if you go back on my videos you'll see and I also do it for the underspin now there's two uh, like I said out there there's two uh, main rules i think that everybody would agree on the the people that throw knives and really there's a lot a lot of them out there that are a lot better than me uh, they're awesome throwers uh i'm just basic you know no thrills but one is don't flick your wrist and two follow through and there's a point of release you know at the target uh you see me throw different weights from the same distance. A lot of people have to walk and make adjustments or whatever. I can do that. It just depends on where I'm going to release it. You know what I mean? But that's what you would. I always aim for bullseye. Just boom, and I'm at the same distance. That's the way I was taught. So I think those are the two basic rules to uh, that everybody would agree on. But again, it's whatever works for you. If you feel comfortable throwing it, by the blade, there's a lot of people. I got some buddies that throw it like that. Do it. Just do it. And have fun with it. You know? Enjoy yourselves. All right. I got to do some editing. And uh, I got to do a short video. I might do it on this. But definitely on this uh, brownie. Okay. Y'all take care. And uh, sog out.